So in the demonstration, a couple of safety tips. First is I always do this behind a blast shield. If not, I make sure that all the students have safety goggles on. One of the reasons it's nice to do behind the blast shield is that one, no plastic or rubber from the balloons fly at the students and it also traps some of the heat that might otherwise get towards the students. The second is to have my igniter, my candle, attached to a meter stick. So I'm a full meter away no matter what. If you choose to do it without the blast shield, one of the effects you can lose is the actual synthesis of the water. So when the balloon is right next to the blast shield, as it explodes, there will be a brief instant where the blast shield will fog up. 